Welcome to Open House NYC. Now today's show is all about luxury living in Connecticut. We are getting things started with a rare look at Thimble Islands, a chain of over 300 tiny islands right off the Connecticut coastline near Brantford. Through the years, they became the exclusive enclave of a lucky few who built their main properties to live amid the quietude that only island living can provide. And now seven, yes, seven of the islands are for sale as one amazing estate. So slip on your deck shoes and climb aboard because we are setting out for sale for a closer look. Hi, I'm Shelley Treader Lynch, Senior Global Advisor of Sotheby's International Realty in Greenwich, Connecticut. Welcome to the Thimble Islands. The Thimble Islands are situated just off the Connecticut coast of Branford. Seven privately held islands that even include this Victorian manor right here on the mainland. So many surprises await and I'm excited to show you around. Hey Shelly, we're all set, hop aboard. Captain's calling, all aboard. Let's go sunning, it's so good for you. Let's go sunning, neath the sky of blue. The first island that we will see is a storied Rogers Island. Let's head ashore. One of the distinguishing features of the Thimble Islands, and in particular Rogers Island, is that it's situated on a bedrock of pink granite which is also the very material from which all the walkways, piers, and terraces were chiseled. And as you approach along these walkways, a magical Tudor-style manor home reveals itself from behind the specimen plantings. Just a few steps in and you realize this place is like no other. With its colors and shapes and dreamlike decor, this home is filled with whimsy. It's a true breath of fresh air. This is the great room, and I think you'll agree, this is designed for a celebration. Streaming with natural light and bursting with color, you can't help but feel happy here. It has a huge fireplace for those winter nights, and for those summer days, access to the terrace through these beautiful French doors. Now you must already know that color is one of the stories of this home. And as we continue, you will notice that each room plays with color in its own unique way. This is actually my favorite room in the entire house. It's sophisticated yet playful. Surprises everywhere delight the eye. It's the kind of formal dining room that you actually want to use. Every time I come into this kitchen, I feel surprised and uplifted. Pinks and oranges, whites and blues swirl together over the wide plank pine floors. Yet it's a true chef's kitchen with all the best appliances. This is the place not only to cook and eat, this is the place to be. Upstairs, there are 10 bedrooms, each with their own style and, of course, their own color scheme. But the master suite is truly something else. Private, quiet, and luxurious, and it manages to be both chic and cheerful at the same time. But on top of it all, it has inspiring views of the grounds, the pool, and beyond which can be enjoyed from the walls of windows or the private balcony. Can you imagine waking up to this every morning? It's paradise. But as glorious as it is, you cannot stand here for very long without wanting to go down and take a closer look. So you head on down there, I'll grab the rosé, and I'll meet you outside. <laughs> 